Pedro just approached me about how the boys robbed Aztecas last night at Moore's. Oh, the boys robbed the Aztecas? Yeah. That's that. I just sent it to you so you have it. Hold on. Uh, let's have a 750. Like three. 375? Like, no, I don't know. It don't matter. Whatever. 375. 750 divided by two. Hey, God, I already got to do fucking feeding for this math, bro. He already called. I already, I already sold him 10. He already calling me for back for more. Bro, see, the only problem I'm having with the boys and the, the robbing shit they're doing is that, like, I don't give a fuck about the boys robbing stuff, but then people are just not going to give us what we always get because, like, I want to see the last time Rami or Kay has done anything to get anything for a fuck that PDM job. And like Pedro just said, he was like, do you realize he was like, I was on a phone call with Mr. K and Mr. K was, well, I was working on a deal with him that we have seven green USBs and I was going to trade him for meth for him and we'll buy directly meth from you guys. I'm trying to work on a business with him and he's still robbing me and doesn't give a fuck. I'm like, yeah, you know, that's just, just how it is, you know? Yeah. Listen, I ain't gonna lie. You, you're not wrong. I mean, I feel like the thing is, the thing is, you know what I want to really test out Pino one day? I want What's to rob that? his I want to rob his main guy that gives him armor all the time and see his reaction from it at the end of the day right a lick's a lick yeah he would be pissed I ain't gonna lie I, I mean listen I, I I'm mean. not disagreeing with you but I that, feel like that, that but that's the thing though it shouldn't be that way is the point yeah if we do a business with people that are helping us a lot we probably shouldn't rob him but sometimes the boys should be seeing red I'm gonna go put most of it away and then I'm gonna grab like seven What's up, just to test it out I mean He's not entirely wrong. No, I mean, no. Okay, yeah. It, it's 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 a double-edged sword, right? It's a double-edged sword. Because if you do business with everyone, then you can't ever fucking rob anybody. If you're just doing business with everyone and you have so many friends, right? Then, then it becomes a problem because you just can't rob anybody because you're just doing business with too many people. But if we're getting... If we're doing... I don't know. Like, if we're doing business with gangs and... Or just not gangs, but, like, people in general. And they're giving us, like, hella shit and they're helping us out a lot. I mean, I, I feel like common courtesy would t be to not rob him, but I don't know. Yeah, Vinny has a lot of guys that he does. That's what I'm saying, though. It's a double-edged sword. You can't have... you If you do business with the whole fucking city, then nobody can rob anybody. Right? But I feel like... I think Vinny's the, the reason Vinny has a problem with it is because that's his main guy, I guess. Maybe that was his... You know what I mean, like, that's not... I guess it's not just any guy. It's his main guy. I don't know. So I think I've made up my mind what I'm going to do also with things. Um, I'm not going to, I'm not going to base what I was to just relieve the headache from me and not deal with bullshit with the gang. I'm making the decision of like not dealing with anybody anymore for anything and let, <laughs> let them get the stuff on their own at this point. That's the way I look at it. You know, no, no, I, don't no, hit I don't listen to no, no, listen, the way I look at it, I listen, don't, I don't hit houses anymore. I literally just, everybody comes to me. Yo, Vin, I got this for this. Can you give me a minute? I'm just, I think the way to relieve that is just not deal with any business with anybody so there's no headaches and then let them get the shit. And let's see how many times they hit PDM a week without me getting the stuff for them, so. I mean, did you speak to Kay about this, though? Did you speak to no, him? No, I or... just found this out from Pedro. Pedro no, literally it... just told me. No, but don't, I, yeah, but don't come to that conclusion without even having spoken to Kay, you know what I'm saying? But I get what you're saying. No, I know exactly what you're saying, Vin. It's a double-edged sword. It's a double-edged sword because... If you do business with too many people, then we can't rob nobody. Because but that was your main the, guy. The, the, the point is that, like, the minute I bet my life on it, right? The minute Pedro told him last night that I work for Vinny and I do deals for Vinny, right away, Kay's reaction, I guarantee him and Rami were like, oh, here we go again. Vinny and all his people he, he's friends with, he's just friendly with everybody. But those people are the people that make you hit PDM once a day. That's the difference. Yeah, I don't, I don't think they see the, the benefit in the moment. That's why they don't see, so, they don't think about the benefit so, in the moment. So to, to not have to deal with headaches, I'm not going to just get anything from anybody anymore and not have those connections anymore with people. So I don't have to deal with the headaches. You understand? And the no, bullshit I know, I know talking about Vinny, about how Vinny's just friendly with everybody. But Vinny's friendly with everybody, but you're able to do PDM daily because Vinny always has the stuff ready and waiting. Vinny always has over 100, 200 pills to go do fucking uh, meth runs. Vinny has over 200 fucking phosphorus and the lithium for you guys to go run, go, go cook meth. 
you never have to worry about anything because of the connections Vinny has. But now Vinny's going to pull those connections and then let's see what they have to do when they have nothing to do anything with. Yeah, trust me. I, I give it to me. I give it to me. I think it's just, I think the boys, they, they get a little mad sometimes when like, when they feel like we have connections to too many people. And then every time we try to rob somebody, they're like, that's what I'm saying. It's a double-edged sword. Yeah, no, you know I get it. I think it's just going to be overall better when like that. There's no excuse with Vinny or anybody else with any, you know, it's just the thing is Yo, that the gang. I do send a meth over there. Are we robbing? But yeah, this event, I think we should take the meth game on a chokehold, bro. Like if we see motherfuckers selling, if they yeah, ain't I'm selling done. for us, we fucking rob them. Be like, yo, dude, if you cooking this shit yourself or you buying this shit from other people, Nah, no more, man. If you keep buying it from other people, you're going to get robbed. You come to us type mm -hmm. shit. You see what I'm saying? But listen, Vin, listen, I'm, I'm going to keep it above what you do. I think what you're saying, I, I get exactly what you're saying. I get yeah, exactly see, what you're saying. The thing is, like, I get you get what I'm saying, but everybody, say, everybody else says Vinny's always bitching. But what I'm going to do, I'm just not going to get anything. When people approach me, say, yo, Vin, you need this, you need I'm No, I don't need nothing because I'd rather break those ties and make sure the boys let them run rampant like they want and then i don't have to deal with no bullshit anymore you know what i'm saying it's just better off that way you know what i mean if you're gonna do that i mean listen I, yeah if you do that that's fine but i think you should try to have a conversation with k before you do that and like explain what you're saying to me because what you're saying to me makes sense to me like yeah i mean you're not wrong i mean half the shit we got is because we, we got connections that we buy from or whatever whatever and that's the reason we're able to do half the shit we do so I, get yeah, what I, you're think, I, 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 I personally think, think that it would just be better off that way. You know what I mean? It's just like, I don't deal with anybody. There's no excuse, but when somebody gets robbed, you know what I mean? And then that's that. I mean, yeah, but just have a conversation with K about it though first. But if he says, yeah, fuck it, then do that. Yeah, fuck it. Just because I don't want ties. people, I don't want people always approaching K when K robs them be like, yo, what are you doing? I work for Vinny. I don't want to deal with that anymore. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I always get stuff for Vinny. I'm not dealing with that anymore. You know, it's just not, it's not worth the headache, you know? Yeah, 100%. I mean, I get, I get Vinny's point, chat. I get Vinny's point, but like I said, it's a double-edged sword. You can't have too many connections because then you can't rob anybody. You know what I'm saying? If you have so many connections, it's a problem. That's so why you should only have like a, like a handful amount of connections. Because you know the funny day. part about the way our gang operates now? Everybody worries about themselves. You have Aria, Ellie having their own house. You got Suarez and fucking Pitar having their own house. There's nobody literally does shit, really, if you think about it. Well, listen, to be fair, though, I think the reason they got their own house is because uh, they, 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 we don't have enough access for the main house. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. They don't all, they, none of them have access for the main house. That's, I, th I think that's why, the reason got, why they got, got their own You got shit. Taco that has his own gang. He doesn't even, like, talk to us anymore, you know? I think what, what Kay needs to do is like literally have a sit down with everybody and I like I've been wanting to bring this up to him and like just have a gang meeting and literally tell these motherfuckers either you're with us or you're not with us and if you're not with us get the fuck out and you don't have to do shit for us anymore you know what I mean that's what I think Kay really needs to do mm. I'm ruthless shit I'm right here local god damn <laughs> Vinny woke up on demon time today